Hi, it's me, Tony. It's July, so I'm having a Harry Potter themed birthday party coming up. And I'm getting things ready right now. I only have the invitations done and they're already sent out, but I'll put a picture here from my Instagram. You can follow me if you want to do that. I use candle wax to close the envelope. The envelope I got online, just like a template, printed it out, cut it out, glued pieces, and on the inside I printed out a platform nine and three quarters ticket. And I also put the acceptance letter, but instead of saying they're accepted to Hogwarts, Witchcraft, and Wizardry, this is gonna be cringy, I know, but I put Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Partying. <laughs> Funny. This was one I messed up on, but it looks like this. I actually fixed it in Photoshop, and just took away all the words and used a different font except for this top part. So it has the crest, that cringiness. It pretty much has the same words as the acceptance letter you find online is, except I used my name instead of Professor McGonagall's name. And I put them head girl and prefect instead of, you know, what Professor McGonagall is. And then I put the date and the RSVP date and I also included, which I do not have with me, I pretty much wrote down things that are going to be happening, like there's going to be games and prizes and finger foods and stuff like that, and dressing up is encouraged but not necessary, if you're going to bring gifts this is the stuff that I like. That's pretty much everything inside the envelope. The wax from the candle was pretty difficult to deal with. And after a certain amount of time, it comes off super easy, and which is not a good thing, but could glue it. But right now, that's all I have, and I have to do decorations, have food supplies, game supplies, photo booth props, prizes, which I pretty much got, but I need to wrap them. I am going to show you some stuff that I got, and that has nothing to do with it. Okay. <laughs> So I'm going to show you some of the stuff that I got and then in the next video you'll see more of what I've done for this party. Let's go look. Alright, so these are for Gringotts Bink. Maybe they'll go in this glass jar that I got. This is to wrap prizes. It's brown paper that I'm going to put twine around. Another glass jar. Other, this is more food stuff, like pumpkin stuff. It's for, you'll see. Here is some, it looks orange, but it's yellow and black because I'm a Hufflepuff. Um, streamers, clear cups that I'm going to decorate. This is for the something else. There has to still be surprises, you know. In here is my most happiest thing that I can't show you exactly, but they're made of glass. This is also a glass thing. Oh, maybe they're right here. Maybe they're, this is the made of glass. And then some boxes to wrap prizes in. I got, oh, that's not mine. I got this food dust to make it more awesome red paint some stuff in here is more prizes and a plate to put stuff on over there is like the colors of the houses they're tablecloths but I'm not gonna use them as that styrofoam to put snitch cake pops on these are plates in all the house colors this is felt. I'm going to make some props out of felt. I needed, this is a string for the thing. That's just uh, some of the stuff. <laughs> this is all for my party. And I'm excited, excited. If 
you like this video, you can go ahead and do that. If you want to see more videos like this, you can subscribe to my channel, but I'm not going to force you because I'm a Hufflepuff. I have Instagram and Twitter if you want to follow me on those. The links are in the description. I'm moving my hands a lot. I post videos on Saturdays, usually at 2 o'clock. And I think that's it. Stay tuned for the rest of the party. Okay, bye.